I went on a date the other night and he made me pay. It was five hundred dollars. Mm-hmm. So I was talking to this guy on Hinge for like probably a week or so, and decided to go out with him in Melbourne while I'm here. We went out to a really nice restaurant, had a great dinner. Like he was pretty, pretty good. Like I w- uh, if I had to da- rate the date, I'd probably say he was like a seven out of ten. Like it was fine. We had lots of cocktails, a bottle of wine. Like it was lots of fun. And then I get up to go to the bathroom, I come back, and the bill's on the table, which, like, that's fine. And it sits there for ages. And, like, we're still talking and, like, whatever. And I'm kind of like, oh, this is, like, a bit, getting a bit awkward now. Like, is he going to say something? Is he going to put his card down? Like, I don't expect the guy to pay, but I always expect him to at least offer. And, like, if we go halves, like, that's so fine. I'm more than happy to do that. Anyway, eventually the waiter comes over and she's like, like, are you guys ready to pay? And he just looks at me and goes, she's paying. $500. And I assume that obviously he's seen all the stories and stuff about how much money I make and just thought, I'd cop the bill. Like, I don't care. I paid the bill, but like, what? So safe to say I will not be seeing that man again. Hey, folks. Welcome to my YouTube channel. What you saw here was the OnlyFans career. For a woman, 26-year-old, forced to pick up a $500 dinner date bill. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So a woman who... Offers uh, often shares um, her dating life online. Has shared a horror date she experienced where a man expected her to pay the entire $500 bill and Knight, who splits her time between the Gold Coast and Melbourne, said she had been talking to a man on a dating app for a week before agreeing to meet for dinner. She said the date was going well, rating it a 7 out of 10 while the pair shared cocktails and a bottle of wine and a meal after going to the bathroom Annie um, who works as an adult content creator for a subscription based service found the bill on the table the pair continued to talk and when the waiter Tris um, comes over and asks who is going to pay the bill uh, the guy um, expects me to pay <laughs> over $500 obviously I was I paid, but it felt really ick. Like he just had an expectation because he just saw how much my income is, she said. Annie um, said she has no problem spending the bill and had no expectation the man would pay, but it said she expect him to at least um, offer. Okay. Earlier this year, Annie um, reviewed she makes um, $150,000 a month due to her line of work. However, her bad date experience left many people frustrated with the content creator pointing out her monthly um, takeaway and that it will barely make a dent in her bank account. Okay, so <laughs> what do you reckon, folks? Um, so, so this is more like a, a thing for the rich where they earn so much money and expect the same in return when it comes to other people. <laughs> All right. So anyway... So I think um, people commenting, um, I haven't watched the full video as I started in the video that I'll be happy to go 50-50. I didn't expect him to pay for the whole thing. So I don't think it's fair uh, he expect me to pay for it um, and told news.com.au. For those um, um, saying I should pay because I earn mil- millions of dollars a year, I think that has nothing to do with it. It's simply a respect thing. He should respect and value my time, therefore, be at least willing to split the bill. Well, do you reckon she has a good point about what comes to dating and efficacy, um, regardless who earns the biggest bucks and so on? Anyway, folks, what are your th- thoughts um, in the comment section? Um, do you reckon she has to cop it, or the guy should at least have the guts to pay for his um, meal on a date? Let your thoughts know in the comment section. Have a good day.